With the anticipated arrival of Atlas's modern commuter train project, we thought this would be a good time to review some of the special features of these models. In analog or DC operation, the locomotive and cab car are equipped with directional lighting. When the locomotive is leading, the headlight and ditch lights will be illuminated, while on the opposite end of the train, the cab car will display a pair of red marker lights. When the cab car is leading, its headlight and ditch lights will be illuminated and the locomotive will then display a pair of red marker lights while shoving the train, just as on the prototype. DCC users gain independent control of all lighting in the locomotive. The cab car is equipped with a 21-pin plug, and users will need to install a decoder to gain full control of the cab car's lighting features. There is also a provision for users to add a speaker to the cab car for the addition of a horn, bell, and other sounds which will be made available by ESU for download on their website. In addition, all trailer and cab cars feature full interior lighting that will operate on both DC and DCC layouts. Many customers have asked if this locomotive will have any problem pulling a prototypical 5 to 8 car train of multi-level cars upgrade. The ALP45 locomotive model weighs approximately 1.25 pounds and should have no trouble at all hauling prototypical length consists on typical model layout grades. All equipment includes factory installed KD number 148 metal couplers and all cars have been carefully weighted and tested for reliable operation in both push and pull modes. This project is very unique for Atlas and is one in which many of us in the research department took a personal interest. The prototype dual mode locomotives and multi-level commuter cars are a very familiar sight to any observers of rail activity in northern New Jersey. Each day, these trains operate through Hillside, New Jersey along Conrail's busy Lehigh Line, which also handles trains of NJ Transit's Raritan Valley Line. Two, four, four. Train speed, three, seven. On a nice day, it is not uncommon for a group of Atlas Railfan employees to spend their lunch break doing field research along the Lehigh Line at a location which is just minutes from the Atlas office. It is also not uncommon to find the ALP 45 DP and multi-level cars operating on the nearby Northeast Corridor. Owned by Amtrak, this line also handles trains of NJ Transit's North Jersey Coast and Northeast Corridor lines. Since this equipment is often found on the Northeast Corridor, we thought it very appropriate to test the first decorated samples on Andy Rubo's amazing Pennsylvania Railroad New York Division layout. This line was, of course, the predecessor to today's Northeast Corridor. While line-side structures have changed a bit since the late 1960s, the overall catenary support system has not changed very much at all, and Amtrak still operates this as a four- and sometimes six-track mainline, just as Andy has expertly modeled. With an anticipated arrival during February 2017, now is the time to check with your favorite Atlas dealers to reserve a modern commuter train set, if you haven't done so already.